been hugely popular. Came from a great family, traditional motorsport people. Her father drove alongside in private term at McLaren. So deep history there. Extremely sad. This is a very somber place at the moment. And I must tell you, when you see drivers, we we'll say Fernando Alonso again, this great Spaniard, walking along, not speaking to anyone, it is a very dim place at the moment because it's a very close committee community here and really everyone is thinking about the sad loss that we had here with this news today and it hasn't really got inside everyone yet but there's a great sense of loss here and her, it was her big crash last year that rocked the sport as well because she crashed during testing didn't she at Duxford lost her right eye in that crash but she'd made such a remarkable recovery she was determined to remain in motorsport wasn't she well, she was a wonderful figurehead because she was the pinnacle. She showed the world how she came out about it, how she was going to beat this, how she was going to find a new life. She was going to come back to motor racing. You know, she's written this great book, which life is a gift. I mean, how appropriate is that? It's been launched on Monday, and, and the sad news that she was in Seville launching this book and, and this fatality, the, the news of her death is extremely sad.